Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix unable to initialize Steam API error. This error can be frustrating, but don't worry, I've got a couple simple solutions for you, so let's get started. First, we will make sure Steam is allowed through your Windows Defender firewall. This is important because sometimes the firewall might block Steam from connecting to the internet, causing the error. To begin, click on the Windows Start button and type Windows Security, then press Enter. In the Windows Security window, click on Firewall and Network Protection. Now, click on Allow an app through Firewall. Next, click on Change Settings and then look for Steam and the list of allowed apps and features. If you don't see it, click on Allow another app, then browse to where Steam is installed, usually in C Program Files 86, Steam, and then select Steam.exe. Ensure both private and public boxes are checked, then click OK. The second step is to run Steam as an administrator. This gives Steam the necessary permissions to operate correctly. Find the Steam shortcut on your desktop. If you don't have one, navigate to the Steam installation folder. Right click on the Steam icon and then select Properties, then go to the Compatibility tab. Here, check the box that says Run this program as an administrator. Click Apply, then OK. After doing this, restart your computer and try launching Steam again. And that's it, you should now be able to launch Steam without seeing the unable to initialize Steam API error. Thank you for watching. If this video was helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this, and click on that notification bell to never miss an update.